Hello! I just got a brand new camera, so to uh, test things out, I am making a test video. And uh, it's going to be about how Joe Valentine from the Resident Evil series fought a werewolf in, uh, in college as um, undercover and why it's canon. So um, this here is an open collection uh, comic. that I have. They used to release magazines uh, with a couple of stories inside and then they did the collection which is what this is and this is the cover to the uh, issue in which Joe Valentine fights a werewolf. So here's a college and uh, there you go warning her don't go outside in a curfew and she's like I'm not gonna listen and then she gets eaten by a werewolf because that's what happens when you uh, skip curfew so remember don't skip curfew or else you'll get eaten by a werewolf see ah, werewolf so then the next day Wesker is uh, sending Jill out to go undercover at this college uh, and sending Barry to to watch her go undercover because he's too old to pass as a college uh, person. Look at his face. He's like, I am too old. And she agrees. So uh, she just goes undercover. Remember, this is just testing. So then Jill shows up. She's in school and she is in her first class and automatically like starts hearing about the uh, murder that just happened. So she goes, it's like, oh, hey, you know, your friend's dead. I'm really sorry about that. Can you give me all the information so that, uh, you know, I can go walk around that same area? Pay, uh, pay attention to Jill's outfit there. Um, her chain is a microphone. And so she's communicating with Barry, and she's like, oh, hey, you know, found the spot. So she starts to get attacked, and she's running away. And she clearly sees that she is being attacked by a wolf. And so she shoots him, and Barry shows up. And Barry's like, you know, I thought you, you said that there was a wolf. It just looks like a naked weirdo to me. Because um, I guess at this point, this happens before Resident Evil 1. So I guess at this point they haven't seen anything uh, weird yet. Which I'm not sure how much sense that makes. Um, so they haven't ever seen anything weird. And then... Jill's like, I never did like school. Jill, didn't, Jill Valentine doesn't like school. Now to add to the connection of uh, this being canon, you see her civilian outfit and locket, which is also an unlockable costume in Resident Evil 1, the director's cut, locket and all. So that's uh, pretty interesting. In the original Sega Saturn, I believe the alternate costume was just a shorter shirt and a green green uh, arm pads instead of blue. For the Rebirth, it was a Santa, uh, Sarah Connor outfit and um, the Nemesis outfit. So they, they've switched out the outfits a few times, but yeah, in the director's cut, she unlocks an outfit, and it's very, very similar to, actually, the exact same one that is seen in the comics. So there you go. Joe Valentine fought a werewolf, and she kept that outfit. 